Hey everyone, it's Ben Hardy here, and today we're going to be going over the all-new 2019 GMC Sierra Denali 1500. You can see this truck, absolutely beautiful. I love the white paint finish on this particular one. But as always, we're going to do a quick walk around on the truck, then we're going to take it out to see how it drives. A big shout out and thank you to National GMC for providing us with the truck. If you're in the market for a new GMC, check out National GMC down here in American Fork. Under the hood here of the GMC Sierra, we have a naturally aspirated 6.2 liter V8. It's routed through a 10 speed automatic transmission. Fuel economy numbers are gonna be 15 around town, 19 on the highway, and power outputs are going to be a massive 420 horsepower and then 460 pound-feet of torque. And you can see just how massive this engine actually is. Now, like I said, I love this white exterior paint, so you can see that it sparkles in the sunlight. It looks absolutely fantastic. We can see that there are LED reflector lights with little LED accent lighting just around that. And then we see we've got fog lights just down below and then we've got parking sensors all around and then you've got the massive chrome grill with the gmc logo front and center so this is kind of more traditional on the truck side of things with the chrome accenting and then you can finally see tow hooks at the bottom around the side here we have these polished 22 inch rims absolutely massive 275 millimeter tires around them but they look fantastic with this truck in the front and the rear and then you can kind of see the little bit of a fender flare just around that. It says Denali on the side. You can see these side steps. We'll go over those later. And then your gas cap in the back. Here is our key fob for the 1500 Denali. You can see there's a couple functions. Your lock and unlock, remote start, tailgate release. So if you lock the truck, hold down the remote start function. That 6.2 liter will come to life. Press that again, that'll shut it off. And if we press this button twice, that'll slow lower down the tailgate. We can see that there is bed liner in the truck. That's to help getting in and out of the truck easier. And then you can see you've got like a little power outlet back here and then there is LED lighting and it says Denali at the very end of the bed right there. And then you do have your cargo light at the top. Now we have this multi-function tailgate. So if we press that, it'll pop down. And then if we press this little latch right here, that fully pops down. So it's like a step to get up into the bed really really easy to use in general and then that helps if you need an arm hold on it and then you still get this little step here on the side of the bumper so overall this is super super simple to get in and out of weight limit on this is 375 pounds now let's lift up this tailgate so you can see initially it's pretty light at the top it weights up a little bit but it's not bad by any means locks into place fully and we can see the gmc logo right here denali Sierra at the bottom and then we can see the little tail light in the back parking sensors dual outlet exhaust and then right there we can see the little receiver hitch and then it has all of the plugins for towing finally LED lights these are the new lights and I just love how these look I think they have a really nice clean look to them in general you can kind of see how those look as I lock the truck now coming around the side Kilo Sentry so one touch to lock it and then you press it again that would unlock it the step will pop out and then we can see the rear here so leather padding right here with the contrast it's stitching all of your wood trim and then looking into the back here you've got this nice leather you've got kind of like this contrasted leather striping in it it's the best way for me to describe it but you can open these little cubbies up for extra storage and then these pop down to be a set of cup holders and then we can open this up so you can see there's extra storage under these seats as well and then you can see right here, we've got heated seats. You've got a couple USBs and a full 12 volt with some vents. Cup holders on the top. Now we've got that same keyless entry in the front. So one touch, you can see that it locks it and then press it again and that unlocks the door. You've got little power folding mirrors right there. And then we can fully open this. You can see more of that leather padding with the stitching, wood trim, your window controls right here, your mirror controls all in that section. And then you've got your memory seats right here, door lock and unlock. A little Denali plaque right there. These are your seats, so fully power adjustable on the seats. And you can actually look at the seats right here. They've got more of that kind of like contrast leather striping. I really love the look of that, but very, very comfortable seats in general. Pedal layout just down below with your little hood latch. Parking brake is right here. All of our light controls are in that area. You got your cargo light, fog light, your drive mode selector here. So 
auto, four wheel high, four wheel low, two wheel high right there. And then the steering wheel is manually adjustable. Now, like I said, you guys saw those little power steps. Those are super easy to use. Makes getting in and out of the truck easy. To start up, put your foot on the brake, push the push start, and then the truck will start right up. So right here, we have all of our controls for that little center screen, voice command, your phone controls, rocker panels on the back of the steering wheel to control the radio stations, it says Denali, and then you've got some trim all around. That's to set the distance on the cruise control, heated steering wheel, and then your regular cruise control. When you look at the steering wheel, I like it in general. It feels nice to touch. Stock on the side for the windshield wipers, turn signal. Other side is to select the gears, and that's also just the shifter. It's a column shifter. So we have our gauges right here. You can see on the left side, you've got your RPMs. On the right side, you've got your speed, and then you've got that little center screen right there. So you can see that there's a couple different menus that you can scroll through on the center screen. Really easy to use and very configurable in that little dial. Very, very responsive to kind of go up and down once you are into a screen. Here is our center touch screen, so you can see that this is very, very responsive in general, really easy to use. The touch screen time is very, very solid. Android Auto, Apple CarPlay on it. You've got your little navigation function on it as well. So in general, really good, solid unit. And if we pop it into reverse, you can see the camera system will pop up. So you can see there's a bunch of different views with this camera system. I mean, you can literally see everything on this truck that you could ever see, every single camera view. Yeah, you guys get the uh, point. Super, super solid camera system. Probably one of the best, if not the best, in the truck industry right now. Now we've got all of our radio controls right here. And you've got like your home screen button right there. Analog climate controls. It is dual zone climate. And then you've got your controls for the heated and ventilated seats for the front. And then you have a bunch of controls right here. So on this control, that is for your side steps. We'll play with that in a moment. Hill descent control. You've got your power outlets, stability control, hazard lights, tailgate release, auto stop start, parking sensors. And then you've got your lane departure systems. Trailer brakes are already integrated. You've got your little controls for the USBs, 12 volt. And then you've got your full power outlet. Like I said, let's go over that little step thing. So if we open up the door, you can see the steps will pop open. Now, if I press this, you see there's a couple different functions right here. So you can see the steps then will pop back or you can just pop them to the side. You basically have those two different points on it. So the reason why you pop them back is so it's easier access to the bed. I really, really like that function. Wireless charging right here, some cup holders, and then we have our full center console. You can actually put your phone right there. It's a really nice place. But opening this up, you can see there's more charging stations right there. Tons of storage space. And we found the window sticker. We'll go over that later. But anyways, we've got the glove boxes right here in this area. So more storage space with those. Nice that they have a dual glove box system. Now I'm gonna have to go over this mirror in every single review so you can see that it's like that dual mirror function so it has a camera on it. So it doubles as like a regular mirror or you can have the camera system which will show you quite a bit more. So you can see I have the mirror emplacement where those two trucks are. You can see them perfectly versus having the rear setting window in the back seats blocking my view. All of our controls for the sunroof are up here, universal garage openers, power rear setting window. That's up here as well and you can see regular sunroof up top and then there are some little microphones up here for the bluetooth now this is cool so this window sticker um well obviously it's not attached to the window so i can actually show it to you guys so here's all of your standard equipment on this 2019 sierra denali crew cab you can see the epa fuel economy numbers i was actually off sorry so it's 20 on the highway not 19. my bad but then you can see the optional equipment that this particular truck has so ultimate package total price before any sort of market adjustment. I actually really like this truck in general. I love the styling on the GMCs. I think out of all of GM's trucks, the GMCs definitely, right now, I, I just feel like they look the nicest. That all being said, let's take this 1500 Denali out to see how it drives. Let's start off here in the Denali and let's first talk about visibility with the truck. So you can see visibility of the hood pretty good in general, but you do have that front camera. So that's going to help out with parking the truck visibility throughout both the mirrors. You guys can see that and then through the rear of the truck as well. So visibility in general on this truck, really, really solid, but let's set off. 
So initially setting off in this 1500 Denali, let's talk about road noise and ride quality. So road noise, very, very minimal in this truck, has a luxury car feel to it on that side of things. And then the ride quality is exceptionally smooth with this truck. I mean, you can see right here with this road, it just floats along. I absolutely love it. Let's talk about the steering with the truck. So there's actually not a whole lot of vagueness with the steering. It's pretty direct in general. It goes pretty much right where you want it to go. So from a steering perspective, super, super solid. I mean, you can see right here, as I am making a turn, it just, boom, right into place. And this drives smaller than it is. Now let's get a little acceleration with this Sierra 1500. Yeah, that 6.2 liter has more than enough power. I don't feel like I have any more need for any extra power in general. I mean, it's just it's just perfect power wise. This 6.2 liter is such a strong offering on the truck market right now. So to sum things up, if you are looking for a luxury half ton, you want something with all of the bells and whistles, safety tech, something that's just a comfortable truck to drive every day, and then something that you can use for truck stuff so you can take it off road a little bit, do some towing with it. This Sierra Denali is a perfect truck. This is your top of line luxury mobile. And I mean, it feels every bit of the way of that. So if you're used to luxury cars, then this truck will fit right into your garage. There we have it everyone, the 2019 GMC Sierra Denali, an absolutely fantastic truck. I love the aesthetics of these new GMCs. I just think that they are so, so beautiful. But as always, if you're stopping for the first time, please subscribe, comment down below what you thought, and then a big shout out and thank you to National GMC here in American Fork for providing us with the truck. If you're in the market for a truck, check out their inventory. I'll put it in the description of this video. I'll see all of you in that next video.